Alright, so this is just a quick video to show you guys how to use the Hide My Ass VPN software. So, I'm not sure how many of you guys actually have this, but there's a lot that do. And uh, yeah, so I know when I first signed up for this company and I downloaded their program, it sure looked pretty, you know, pretty daunting. I didn't really know what to do with all these menus and settings and all that, but it turns out to be pretty easy. As you can see here, I'm connected to the San Diego server in in America. That's how I use Netflix and all that. So I'm just going to go and go ahead and close that, and then get out of that on Twitter, and then open it back up. Okay, so first off, all you all you're going to need is dashboard. You're not going to need any of these unless you know, you just want to tweak the settings a bit. You don't need any of these at all. Let's be disconnected for now. So, username and password need to be the same one that you get into your uh, Hide My Ass dashboard or control panel with on their website. So, that's my username, that's my password. I'll just show you guys where that is. So, if we go. HideMyAss.com, ProVPN. Login. And then there you go. So it's the same username and password. It takes you to get into this bit here. Back to the program. You don't have to touch any of these, but you should leave it on. Remember my username and password. That's the only one you really need. You don't really need that one or that one. Alright, so here's the important bit. So protocol. PPTP or OpenVPN. They're basically exactly the same, except sometimes OpenVPN will be faster or PPTP will be faster, depending on your connection. I know for my connection, PPTP was a lot faster. I don't know why, but that's one of the main things I always suggest when you're having speed problems, is to change the protocol. So to the right of that is the server selection. So it's got all of these different servers here. All you need to do is either choose the fastest one or the closest one to your area or whichever one you want. So I'm just going to go ahead and choose Los Angeles, California. And you don't need to do anything here. That's all you need to do. And then click connect. Let it load for a little bit. Just let that go. And here you go. Sometimes it messes up and chooses your closest server. Just, you know, instead of the server you chose, which is really annoying. And I'll show you guys how to fix that afterwards after this connects. As you can see, it's for some reason chosen to connect to Jakarta in Ind Indonesia instead of Los Angeles. Don't never connect. Indonesia sucks. All you're going to do is go to country selection. Go to North America or wherever your preferred server is. San Diego, that's my favorite one. Check that. And there you go. It's connected to San Diego. You just wait on that for a bit. Here we go. Connected to USA, California, San Diego. That's all there is to it. Don't need to play around with any of these at all. It will all be fine. Don't need to go in the connection log. Don't need to go into the settings. It'll all be fun. And now you're free to use it. You can go on Netflix or do whatever you want. And all your traffic will be routed through their server of your choice. So thanks for watching. Please uh please subscribe if you want more videos similar to this.